welcome back to my channel welcome back to another episode of craft with me still crafting my easter bag i did make an episode i did not upload because i figured i tried to make something and it didn't work out at all and it was the whole episode and i thought if this doesn't work out at all zero there's nothing i can do maybe i should not be uploading that i was you know debating so if you want to you can let me know in the comments if i make an episode of craft with me and um it's a super fail there is just nothing working would you still like to see that because i was debating and i decided just to not to upload it it's not because i'm concerned about myself oh i see this opened up that's a good thing so i just um I did something it didn't work and then on the same episode i filled up the little eggs here and i see that this one does not want to stay in there and why not <laughs> you know it opened the egg so it's a good thing if you do everything like i told you so many times um and then you have it at home for a little while and you can see if things actually stay in a way you want them to stay so i'm going to put the that aside because i decided to do something else as well so this opens up really big and i don't know <laughs> i don't know if i'm gonna put the eggs in there or not but i wanted to make two or try to make two pockets right here i thought maybe that would be really cool <laughs> Well, maybe it will be a super fail. I don't know. I really don't want this episode to not to be uploaded. So to do that, I would have to glue some paper on there as well. And I would say I would glue half of whatever this is. What is this? It's seven inches. So I'm going to go with three and a half inches and that should be enough. Let's hope. <laughs> Let's hope. Okay, let me cut this. It's so cold in my room still. It's super warm outside already, but my room doesn't warm up. And because I'm sick all the time, I have to wear my super thick hoodie here. I feel cold. I just feel cold all the time. Okay, so this could be enough. Hopefully, hopefully this is going to be enough. So what I need to do is to square it and to see how I'm going to fold it. I have no clue what I'm doing. As always, I really don't know. I'm just going to go with my gut and do whatever I think I should be doing. <laughs> and then hope for the best, as always. I'm just going to go ahead and square it every half an inch how many times one two three four five let's just do a little more oops that was not half an inch that's half an inch it's hard hard because it's inches i'm just gonna square it all the way of the board here you know who cares then i have some squared paper Okay, now what I want to figure out is how many I would need for my pocket. Because I want to make like this gasset, I, I guess you call it. But I think it's going to be a little more than that. Where is my <laughs> fourth of an inch score? I don't want to fold it. Okay, maybe like this. You see, I want to stick it in here and then have it open up some... And I believe that's enough. I'm going to do one more just in case and then just cut. And then I have to remember how many I did. <laughs> Went to three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Anybody remember for me? <laughs> it's eight. <laughs> just in case I forget, which I will. Oh my God, things are going on here. <sighs> I tried to keep up with cleaning my room, but it doesn't get better because every time I do a cleanup, I basically clean up what I was um, doing before, you know, so <laughs> clean up the mess from before. Okay, let's see. 
And this is also going to hold the bag kind of a little bit. And I think that's too many. Eight is too many. Yeah, I'm going to go with six. This is how you figure out anything you're crafting. If you don't know the exact measurements, if your bag is different, you know, everything could be. That's how you figure out the measurement you need. You just try it out. I have to hold it here so I would glue it down here. And then this would be held like this. Oh, yeah, you don't see anything. Okay, now I'm trying to see if I want to go with four even and just have a little kind of bag in there. Let me figure that out. Okay, so I decided to go with four. I got myself two right away and I'm going to glue them right here so i kind of have a little pocket in there and my bag doesn't is not that flimsy because my bag being so super flimsy is kind of annoying to me i'm gonna use you can use your double-sided tape but i don't trust it in projects like this so i'm going to use the glue and I'm going to put it from both sides so I can just, you know, stick it in there and have it in there. Just like that. So when I stick the upper part on top, I glue both sides and I'll be good with that. Okay, now I want to figure out of course, <laughs> I want to be kind of at the same spot here. So I'm going to make a tiny little mark right there and do the same thing with my second one. Some glue from both sides. Oh. You know, I'm not quite sure what I was telling you in my last episode that I didn't upload. <laughs> That's why I'm not sure what I can tell you or if I'm saying something for the second time. Because, you know, in my brain, I said this before. <laughs> I feel like I did, but I got my new glasses. So if I told you that already, and I apologize, <laughs> because I think it was in the episode I'm not going to upload. But if not, then you, you heard it twice. <laughs> so I, I apologize for that. <laughs> yeah, however, I got my new glasses. It's so bad. It's so bad. Oh my God. I don't know. You call them progressives, I believe. But this is like three sync something. It has three different spots. And, you know, when your eyes have to see things three different times, like... It's weird. They say you have to wear them for a while so you get used to it. I can't get used to it yet. I'm kind of upset. I'm thinking they did something wrong, you know, because I can't see. <laughs> I can't see. Okay, I think this is better. So look, the bag is not going to be... It's only going to open up like this. And this is still enough to fill it up. And then I have a little spot, tech spot right here, you know. I could put stuff in there and it stays in there. So I'm not even sure if I'm going to put my res um, my want in here or if I'm going to um, have it, ship it in any other way, you know, package it in any other way. I'm not quite sure if it's going to stay this way. I'll figure something out. But see, now it's tucked in and it doesn't fall around back and forth. And I like it much, much more. Also, I was thinking about this. This is kind of long. This is probably way too long. So I'm thinking that I will shorten it and give two embellishments and not three. Because if I stick two in there, then the back topper is going to be here. Or even if I stick it in the front pocket. But three, look, I push three in and it's kind of long, isn't it? 
or maybe I make, I'm not going to cut it yet. So <laughs> let's see it this way. I will see a little later how I'm going to do that. But okay. So far, so good. Now, in my other video, I believe I uploaded it. <laughs> I want to show you something. Um, the little embellishments that I was making. And I was talking to you in the video and told you that this is foam and it's going to slide. And look, it slid. And when I edited my video, I saw it <laughs> showing you and it slid and it was so funny. But there was nothing I could do. So I'm just going to rip it off. It's not hard to rip off because this is a foam sticker. <laughs> I'm just going to rip it off and glue it down in the right spot. And now I will make sure that it's not sliding and put it aside. But for the other bunnies, I would like to make, um, put them in a little bag and have the bag decorated, you know, just like I did here with my other embellishments. And I'm thinking of using this one. It has a hole here. I didn't see the hole. What, what is going on? on i do have another they all have a hole what's happening here <laughs> i have one with this sticker on it i'm sorry about the sounds this is making but yeah i have one with the sticker no that doesn't work i guess i'm just gonna they all have a hole for some reason it's gonna still it's still gonna look all right right well we'll see let's see i'm gonna do two i guess Two bunnies and I'll keep two bunnies for the next time <laughs> or give them to somebody else or use them on a project somewhere but two bunnies is cool this one is I have my mat the wrong way around <laughs> which is annoying right now because I have to measure from the wrong side oh my god I just I just was saying that I don't see anything so this is five and a little bit Five and a quarter by five. I'm gonna cut a paper by five by five, probably. And let me see the background. It's not too bad. I'm gonna put some some pretty background paper in the back. Okay, so I cut myself a piece of paper. I used my embossing folder because I promised myself to use more of my stuff and it is not the full size of the paper. So I'm just going to put some washi tape right on there. You know, I was just thinking, why not? I have washi tape too, I have to use. I don't have many. <laughs> I don't have many Easter washi tapes, just a couple actually, but whatever, I need to use them up. And I just had mine right here there were this i found it this is washi tape i was gifted by my bestie and she put them i'm not gonna tell her but she put them in a way that the lower one was stuck underneath so i couldn't take it off okay i'm gonna take care of this in a bit because it's a year old. She gave it to me last year. I have to use it up. It's not going to work. Otherwise, it's not going to stick anymore ever. So I'm just going to put the chickies right here. A piece that doesn't belong there. And now if it's long enough, because it's just actually a piece. Oh, yeah, it's long enough. Because it's long enough, I'm going to stick the same one on the bottom right here and put the purple one back on. <laughs> it's not much left of the purple one and it's going to just go all over the chickies because it's not sticking anymore. Not that good. So I'm going to use my tool here just to push it down and make it stick better but it's not not good anymore and it's not her fault it's mine <laughs> because you know we have to use stuff up maybe she gave it the year before that but i believe it was last year 
However, that's the problem if you only give like the same holiday embellishment because we cannot use it up in the same year and then things happen. Okay, and I'm gonna put two of them right on top, package it up and hope that it's big enough, small enough. Okay, I do need my dots right there. Plop. So I think I'm gonna put them like this. So let's get the glue dots on there. Right here, push because this is embossed now, it's not going to stick that good if you don't push. And now push. That's why I made this circle on the embellishment as well. You know, so there is something to hold on to. Otherwise, you know, it's just going to fall off, fall off. Okay, second one right here. Push. I'm gonna do it with my fingernail and then have the bunny right on top here. Wonderful! <laughs> Aren't they cute? Now, I'm not sure if I have to cut down the paper a little bit. Let's see if this fits into the baggie. First of all, that's what I need to see. Because if you do the same length paper like your bag and then you do an embellishment that's raised up, it's not gonna fit. I learned it. <laughs> Trust me. Trust me. Okay, let's see. Let's see, let's see, let's see. Yeah, because I cut it smaller, it fits pretty good. And now I'm going to glue it down right here. Where's my tool? I need to make a new crease because, you know, I need this. I need some space on the top for my back topper. But it's cute. <laughs> I made something. <laughs> Look at that. And because I have leftover paper now from my project before, I'm just going to cut that off and this piece off and have a back topper almost done. So, this little piece right here and this little piece right here. Of course, I'm going to do something if there's a back topper. I'm not going to just leave it like that. Where is my scissors? I'm going to make the back topper pretty. I will use the Fiskars scallop. Oh my god, I remember at the very beginning of, you know, when I started out crafting, I got those. I got them at Walmart, and I was so excited to have them because they would cut scallops, and the other one cuts pikes, I believe you say that. How do you pronounce that? Do you say pikes? So yeah, however... I was very excited because back then, of course, I didn't have anything to craft with. And now I could get scallops. <laughs> and that was wonderful. Okay. Now all I have to do... See, sometimes it doesn't cut very good, though. But otherwise, they are pretty good. If you don't have anything else... Or even if you do, it goes so fast. Fold, fold, crease. Okay, so that will be the back topper. For here, let me cut off this tiny piece here. I have. I'm cutting and there's still washi tape on there and I cut absolutely quick cut. Okay, now that's straight. Okay, but I'm not going to leave it just like that. I'm going to put something on my back topper so it looks pretty. And just because I have the crepe paper I need to use up now, I'm thinking 
about just, you know, making a crepe paper something on top of it. And I could also use my pen. You know what? That's not too bad. Let's figure out real quick, real quick, <laughs> how, how much I would need, kind of, because it's really um, wide. Even though for another project of mine I wanted to do, and that was the one I didn't upload, I think I, I needed wider crepe paper. That was my little problem, you know. Okay, so I'm going to cut right here just in case I need a little more and then I'm going to make it another size because it, it just is too wide. I want a little bit of the green to be visible so I'll fold it and then I will cut off a piece. Let's see, no, more. <laughs> Why don't we just cut? Okay, then there will be a little bit of the green visible, which I think is super good. And I will be sticking it down here, but I need another color. And I'm thinking about really orangey orange <laughs> because I want my edges to be colored up. So I'm going to do the orangey orange right here everywhere. very orange but I do have orange ribbon on my project too I don't know is the drying out I have barely used this one see it's not too good here do they dry out by themselves if you don't use them in a while because you know I don't use them all the time my markers I should I should color again just color something up Okay, will it be enough? It might be. No, I don't have anything on here. Okay, you know what? I'm just gonna do that. And I think I'm gonna take, I'm sorry, I had my pen in my mouth. Maybe that's something I should not be doing on cam. But I'm going to take a piece of paper and try to do it this way. Maybe because it is, dry kind of normally there would be so much ink coming out that I just have to dab it and it would be enough for the whole thing but apparently it's drying out on me so I have to draw it doesn't matter you don't have to be like exact at all because you know we are going to fold this and then put it as a back topper but I'm just going to put it everywhere just a little bit and I believe that will be it because I can't sit anymore. Things happen to me. <laughs> Things happen to me. I can't sit too much. But I hope it's still fine with you that, you know, sometimes the videos are a little shorter, sometimes they are a little longer. At least we have figured out what to do to our bag, right? And I have told you that my glasses suck. <laughs> I paid like, I don't know, $500, I believe, for the glasses. And I, well, I have to be realistic. I can see better like this. Now I can actually do something here without putting it to my eyes. But I can't see far really good. And <laughs> not seeing far is my bigger problem actually than not seeing clothes because I'm walking around more than I'm crafting, you know, I need to look far. Okay, so we did this. Let's finish this up in the next episode, but you know, this one is done for now. I will be done soon, I promise. One day I will be done, <laughs> but it's almost Easter, so I have to hurry up. There will be just a couple more episodes, and then whatever happens, happens, and I will be sending it off. So, yeah, I hope you enjoyed this anyways, and if you did, as always, <laughs> give me a thumbs up, share, subscribe, and enjoy your day, guys. I will see you next time. Bye-bye.